Today we're hunting sharp tail in central Manitoba. We are hunting a community pasture here uh, that probably hasn't been grazed in about two months here. And it's ideal habitat where we're gonna find uh, a sharp tail grouse. So one of the keys to finding sharp tail is, uh, is pasture land or grazed habitat. Before cultivation of land, buffalo roamed and they grazed and provided that habitat for sharp tail. Now we rely on cattle. That's why we're in a cattle pasture uh, to provide the right habitat for the birds and the vegetation for their food and the raising of their young. As the summer progresses into fall, the sharp tail often move to areas where there's a little more heavier cover uh, to provide some shelter from uh, migrating raptors. So as you can see in this area, we have a lot of bluffs of cover and the birds will usually not be too far from them at this time of year. Yeah, it could be a roosting area. Just the, the habitat's perfect for them. They got a little bit of scrub. They got a little bit taller grass that they can roost for the night. It's fairly open, so if they need to get up quick, they can get up quick. There's nothing inhibiting them from, from get taken off. So these are called buffalo berries, and it's one of the food sources for sharp-tailed grouse that we find in the pasture lands that we hunt uh, sharp-tail in. Other food sources include uh, insects and small, small greens such as clover and uh, other small vegetation that we find in grazed pasture lands. Today we had the opportunity to pursue sharp-tailed grouse in Manitoba. We are hunting the Interlake region and we were able to harvest two birds. This is a younger bird from this spring a little bit smaller and this is a mature bird that we've harvested from probably last year's uh, hatch. These birds are uh, definitely a rewarding experience. You can put on a lot of miles and find something or sometimes you can find a lot of birds or no birds. And uh, today we were fortunate enough to find about three or four cubbies and we took these two birds out of those cubbies and we will be enjoying a meal remembering our hunt today. Manitoba, Canada's heart beats.